So guys, before I start the video, I just want to say that my head is hurting right now, but I decided to make a video anyway because it's Saturday. Um, so if I seem like I don't have any energy or I um, stumble up on my words, I apologize. That's because I have a major headache and I just want to finish this as soon as possible. Now, without further ado, let's... Hey guys, you're back. So, uh, recently, I have come across a person with a characteristic that I do not like, and that is showing off. I know arrogance is not a good thing. I know that, you know, everyone knows that. Recently, I came across a person that um, I played with online on Injustice 2. I played with him and he shows off. He was like, Let me tell you something. You would need a lot of experience to be my character. You can't, you can't, you can't, you can't beat my character. No way, no way. I'm gonna beat you so hard. And then he was like, You think you can beat me? Oh my god, you're greatly mistaken. No way, dude. You're never gonna beat me. You need a lot of practice. You're a f idiot. You're a loser. Yeah, so I seriously do not like people who are arrogant. They feel like they, they can win everything and they feel like they're the best. When people beat them, they just run away like little cowards. I don't really understand. If that theory is wrong, if I feel like I'm the best in the world and I get beaten up by somebody, it wouldn't be, it wouldn't be nice. The thing, the thing is, people are too confident sometimes and they misunderstand the whole concept of gaming or life in general. People think that they're better than everyone else and it's not a, it's not a bad thing, it's a natural, natural uh, thing that humans have. Sometimes I do think that I'm better at my sister in, in spelling or, or in English or something like that. But it doesn't give you the right to show off, to um, put yourself above others just because you're a little bit better than them. Some people talk a lo load of crap, you know, especially in online go gaming, they, there are a lot of things and a lot of guys who are trash talking, who, who think that they're like gonna beat you or whatever. You just don't have to listen to them sometimes. They're just showing off because they're afraid. They're afraid of what your skill, they're afraid of your level. That goes on in real life. My message is this, if people are looking down at you, if people are bringing you down to the earth and people are kicking you down, just stand back up. Arrogance is a thing. You can't get rid of arrogance. Karma is gonna get back to them. The people in the online community that are showing off and, and boasting about their skills, they're not gonna go away. And the best way to deal with that is to prove them, prove to them that you're gonna win. And you're gonna be the best player in the world of the online community without people knowing that you are. And that's the best part about it. That person, I'm not gonna name any names, but that person uh, beat me three times, four times even, he was really good. When I did beat them, they were like, Oh man, you can't even play, you're just doing raw back threes all the time. Like, you can't even do skills, you're not a gamer, you, you're, you can't play injustice, blah, blah, blah. You can't be arrogant if you can't prove your worth. If you are a very, very good person in that particular field, then you could. If you are an F1 racer or if you were a marine biologist or something like that, you could show off because not everyone can do that. But if if it's an online community where everyone is playing the same games that you are, you can't show off your skills like that. You can, but at least if someone beats you to it and if someone beats your skill, don't run away like a coward. That just shows people 
how it's just a facade, it's just a, it's just a way for you to scare people when you're not actually good at the game. So, my advice is to not let people bring you down, even if it's in the video game. If people think that they're good, they're not actually good until they prove themselves. They're not actually good until they beat you. And if they even beat you, you can't just run away. Like, Injustice the game has two rounds. Every time I every time I fail, every time I, I get beaten, he always says <laughs> You're so so naive. And then eventually I did beat them and he just runs away. Don't worry, I didn't make any enemies. Um every time I beat someone or every time you know someone beats me if they don't show off or if they are humble about their skills and they're not you know trying to be above anyone else I would send them a friend request in PlayStation and then I would say oh good game uh, we can be friends no hard feelings blah 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 and we can play it all over again and it's it's all fun and games <laughs> Again, I emphasize the point of arrogance. They exist in the smallest things possible. Games aren't even real, yet arrogance is. If there's someone that's arrogant in your life and they're showing off just because you, they can do things that you can't do, just prove to them that you can and the whole thing will be over. I hope you enjoyed today's video and I'll see you guys soon. Bye guys!